Well, India is ready for the maiden commercial launch of its heaviest rocket. Just hours from now, the Indian Space Research Organization is all set to launch its LVM-3M2 mission to space. At exactly about 12.07 hours Indian Standard Time on Sunday, the launch vehicle is scheduled to blast off from the Satish Dhawan spaceport in southern India's Sri Harikota. Now, the launch is, of course, historic as the rocket will carry a payload of nearly about six tons. In this commercial mission, ISRO will be placing about 36 OneWeb satellites within the low Earth orbit. Now, OneWeb is a joint venture between India's Bharti Global and also the United Kingdom's government. The initiative seeks to have a constellation of about 650 satellites in low Earth orbit to offer internet and communication services worldwide. The UK-based satellite internet provider has signed up to about two launches with ISRO. Now, ISRO's commercial arm, New Space India Limited, has been awarded two launch contracts from this company, and the mission upon its success will also mark several firsts for India and also its space program. For instance, this will be the first commercial mission of LVM-3. It is also the first multi-satellite mission with 36 OneWeb satellites on board. Moreover, the launch will also be the first of the GSLV Mark III to the low Earth orbit, and lastly, it is the first Indian rocket with a six-ton payload. The launch will mark the entry of GSLV Mark III rocket, renamed as LVM-3 for this mission, into the global launch market. And the GSLV Mark III is India's heaviest rocket, weighing a staggering 640 tons. It's a three-stage launcher, powered by solid, liquid and cryogenic fuel. Now, the geosynchronous satellite launch vehicle Mark III rocket can carry a payload of nearly about 10 tons to low Earth orbit. In the past, the GSLV Mark III has flown four times till date for India's domestic missions with an impeccable record of success in all four of its flights. And our correspondent Siddharth MP has been tracking this story pretty closely for us and has sent us this report from India's Satish Dhawan Space Centre. Take a look. We're coming to you from India Spaceport, the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Harikota in Andhra Pradesh on what is a very momentous occasion for the Indian space program. India's heaviest rocket, the GSLV Mark III, will be lifting off from here in the early hours of Sunday. The launch is scheduled for 12.07 a.m. And this particular launch is so special because of the fact that it will be the first ever commercial mission of the Mark III rocket. And the 640-ton rocket will be lifting off with nearly 5.8 tons of payload to low Earth orbit. So this rocket will be carrying 36 satellites that are from a UK-based low Earth uh, orbit satellite, uh, satellite constellation company known as OneWeb. So they aim to provide low Earth orbit communications. That is, internet services will be beamed from space back to Earth from low Earth orbit. And that is what uh, that company aims to do. So ISRO is facilitating this launch here for OneWeb. And we'll have to remember that this is also a launch that will be tracked at sea by an ocean research vessel known as Sagar Nidhi, operated by India's National Institute of Ocean Technology. So this particular vessel has been parked at a predetermined location in the Indian Ocean and from there the uh, powerful radars and antennas on board that vessel will track the rocket as it flies over the Indian Ocean region and heads for the South Pole. Basically this rocket will be going on a polar path which is known as polar low earth orbit so when it approaches the South Pole and there are no uh, tracking stations, ground tracking stations, it will be that vessel uh, at sea which will be tracking the rocket and telling the people at ISRO's Mission Control Center about the mission's progress. This is a highly anticipated mission and this will also mark India's entry into the medium lift launch category especially in the commercial services market where India can launch satellites of foreign countries or Indian companies itself and then thereby earn revenue in the process. With video journalist Argar from Sri Harikota, this is Siddharth MP, Vion World is One. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.